How's it guys? What is up? Loot Games and today we are doing Terraria Xbox One Edition. Now, we're going to go check out some of the stuff because I've been reading your comments and you have noticed a lot of the pets which I've been trying to get. So we're going to go up and have a look if we can find some of these things. So a couple of people were saying that they saw the cabbage and that they saw the seaweed and they also saw another pet. I can't remember which one it was. I think it was the baby dinosaur, which is the amber mosquito. And <laughs> these chests are so wonderful. I really do need to... I will... I promise that I'll organise these very soon. I might get a couple of people to help me with it. And I've got a few people who said they would help. So that'd be great. And I do need to sort it out into, like, pets, vanities, and all that sort of stuff. But we're going to just see if we can find anything at the minute. <laughs> so we need the um, amber mosquito, which I believe someone said was in the first few chests, the first two gold chests. So we're looking out for a cabbage, and I'm, now I, need, I know this is one of the pets, but I've already got one of those, so I'm sort of just going to keep that there, because it's a duplicate of the one that I've already got. Now, the amber mosquito and the cabbage was in the first few chests, apparently, so I'm going to look out really closely for them, <laughs> and see if I can get them. I'm pretty sure someone said the first few chests. See, when I'm looking back on the recordings, I saw them, and now I've just completely, again, forgot where they are. But I'm pretty sure someone said it was in the first few chests. And I've been re like I said, I've been reading your comments. The amber mosquito, the cabbage, and I'm pretty sure you, uh, you guys saw the seaweed as well. Somewhere. So the, 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 that's a petri dish, but I've already got one of those. We're looking for a cabbage. Honestly, when I'm looking here, I'll look back at the video and I'll be like, yes, it'll be there. But then, <laughs> I don't know if I... Wait, did I already bring them here? That's lime cap. That's not... the. I don't know. I honestly have no clue. I've... No clue. Literally... If you guys know where they are, <laughs> comment me. I, I've really got to sort this out. So we're going to go here. And I did put a few of the uh, pets in here. So, so far, we've got these ones. We've got the... Toy sled, which summons the baby snowman. The pet tiffer, which is the beeswax. Pet slime, petri dish, baby hornet. Pet bat, pet sapling, pet werewolf. The eyeball spring and the baby skeleton head. And I don't know if someone said it was in these chests. I, I honestly don't know. I, I need to go back and watch my recording again because I've completely, like I say, just gone brain dead. <laughs> there's got to be somewhere. There's, there's got to be a cabbage. That that looked like a cabbage. I was like, is that a cabbage? No. I'm pretty sure the dinosaur pet I was using at one point. But yeah, I'm going to give a shout-outs today. So, I don't know if I've already gave these shout-outs. But basically, there's Frostbark, Hunter p -Sec, and I couldn't put the E for some reason. Because apparently, Hunter is a word you can't use. But that is Hunter. I know I've got the T and the E missing, but I put that there so I remembered. So that's Hunter, the Squirrel Game in HD, Silent Ice P, Ryan Gray, Ryan8649, Bad Pig123, XX Legit Sniper XX, P The Pie of Pies, Killer Wizard123, Hector Gonzalez, EJ Reapers, Joe Price and Penguin, which are really big inspirations of mine. There's Drazer Wiker, Zach, Collective TV, Pixel Nation YT, Liam Harding, Jacob Beers. Kiwis, is that how you say it? I, I'm sorry if I said that wrong. And Burning Vin... Vintini? Vintini? I don't know. 59. But yeah. Well done on getting on the wall. To get on this wall, all you have to do is stay active. Literally. All these people have stayed active on my channel. And they've got a shout out on the wall. And I'm going to add more to that next time. This time, I'm just going to shout those out because there was a lot of names there. And I can't believe, once again... I can't find these pets, L literally. It's going to annoy me for ages, that is, because... Come on, they've got to be somewhere. I remember I remember leaving the Amber Mosquito in one of the chests, and I don't know why, but when I'm looking back to actually get it, you can't see it. God, it's got to be somewhere. I'll, I'll spend one more... I'll look one more time, and if I can't find the cat... I know I've got them. But I just don't know where they are. This is why I need an organized chests, which, yeah, I'm pretty sure someone said the first few chests. And I have no clue. Uh, literally, I would have left, to be honest, I would have left the Amber Mosquito down here in the gold chests. 
So it should be here, if anywhere. And I'm, I'm just blind, so if you do see it, comment which chest you saw it in. If I don't find it in the next few seconds. Because literally, I have no clue. Nope, not in there. Not there. Literally lost them. I don't know, not there. <laughs> so unorganized. I feel so bad about this. Like, I need to organize them. But I know, I know I do have the baby dino somewhere because I used to use it all the time. Like, I like so. I'll just look back on the record anyway. We'll get back into this episode today. So we're not going to be in my wonderful world today, which we have explored a lot. Like, <laughs> I've got places where I haven't explored still, but... Just look how much I've ex actually explored this world. This is the part where I want to explore the most. But we're going to do that in an other episode. Because today, we're going to go off. And as soon as we're off... And I'm going to read your guys' comments back again as well. Because you did point out loads of the pets. So thank you for that. I really do thank you. And somebody picked up on... I always moan about having inventory space. Like, none. But I love mining. So I guess that's why Oh, one of my friends is playing. So we're going to go into... Dungeon... Or should we make it? No, we'll go into dungeon because I know this world is going to be... I'm going to spawn at the dungeon, basically. That's if we do still spawn at the dungeon anyway. No? Okay, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, I brought my uh, bed with me, didn't I? Doesn't matter. So, also minions, like the pygmy stuff. I don't class them as pets, really. Even though I'm going to add them eventually. I don't really class them as pets at the minute, so... If you suggest anything like the Raven Staff, Pygmy Staff, and stuff like that, they're more minions to me. They're, they're less pets and more, like, I don't know. I guess they are pets because they go as a pet buff and very similar. So I do, I do realise that. And hopefully me and Torn can do some more hardcore series soon. And I'm really hoping I can release these videos more often. I just got to find time to record more, to be honest, There's, Always other videos that I'm either doing or I'm recording someone's world whenever I record worlds. Or if I'm in that time, I'm doing giveaways or something like that. So, something always comes around. So I do try my best to bring out the best content I can for you guys and what I can do. Now, I know my dungeon is definitely this way, but there we are. So the guide is homed here and I sort of destroyed it last time I come in here. And I just thought of something. I killed Skeletron, didn't I? Good. So, we won't get absolutely wrecked by the Dungeon Guardian. And there is water candles down here, and I've got a few on me, so that's good. You know it's a new world because it's got copper in it. That, that is actually copper, that's not anything else. Sorry if you can't see. I try to light the place up with my wisp in a bottle. So, because we're in pre-hard mode, we've got more of a chance of the little head spawning. Now, I can remember someone saying that the little head spawn less... Uh, if it's not one block thick or something like that. I don't know. They don't spawn through solid blocks. Or something. I, I honestly can't remember what it said. Oh, bunny statue. I've got to take that. I love bunny statues. They come in handy a lot. Some of this, and then we could pretty much get everything killed for us. Got a free golden key. I don't think it's worth even opening any of the chests. I've not even explored this one yet, so it could, there could be anything. Oh, look at all this. The biome chests are right next to each other at the start of the map. There could literally be anything in here. I'm going to I'm gonna use the Horseman's Blade less just in case one of the heads do come out. And then the Horseman's Blade kills it. And if it does drop a Nazar, I won't know, will I? So I think it's best to maybe wait. Oh, there's another one. Oh, the band mechanics down here. How are you doing? How are you doing, Sheena? Are you doing well today? I hope you are. But just don't get killed, will ya? Go and make use of yourself somewhere. I don't know. Where where can she go? She go make some food for the guide. I mean, he's he's always on his own. So, well, we're collecting a lot of junk. Come on, I love that junk. Wait a minute. Did he die from a trap? I think I think he must have died from a trap. <laughs> I was just looking at him. I was like, wait a minute. Did did the, the, the ele Electri electrician mechanic kill him. I always see the electrician. I don't know why. I just got into a habit of saying it recently. Oh, we've got a clothier voodoo doll. What's the chance of drop one of these dropping? Like, really? Get another, get another skeleton doing that. Get the bookcase. I like, I like bookcases. I like to decorate with the bookcases. So I might make a massive room just with bookcases in. So we're gonna go deeper down now. We've got to go deeper and th further in. 
to the dungeon. It is a really nice dungeon, to be honest. I really do like it. So a normal chest in here. And I want to see if the glitch is still available. What's down there? That looks really nice. Um, can I, could I just cut through there? That looks like a really nice room. Oh, we got ourselves a uh, web-covered chest. Of course, it has the web slinger in it. Let's get rid of some of this junk. I know it's junk, guys. Don't worry. Uh, we don't need that many torches, do we? And there we go. We have got ourselves some hunter potion, which is awesome. And 20% arrow speed increase. Nice. Not not too bad. Not too bad. we to pick up the chest as well, along with it. So what can we delete for that? Suspicious looking eye. Why not? There we go. It's not really deleting. It's more using it. But it's not going not gonna to cause any problems. That minion could probably just kill it. Just just put some... Uh, some there we go. Just put that there. Whoa, there's spiders spawning in there. This eye of Cthulhu is nothing for... As if we just gone... Is this world just the best world ever, guys? We go straight from having a spider biome, straight into the dungeon, but straight in to another chest, which is pretty insane, I think. It's actually pretty lucky. So I'm going to trash this. Trash, 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 trash. Keep that. Don't know why I'm keeping that, to be honest. <laughs> Should just trash it, but... Oh, I've got more junk. Awesome. Dynamite junk, band of regeneration junk, gold bar junk. You know how it is. Get all that junk. I don't need it. I want, I want that piano, though. Oh, an anvil as well. But I do want the piano. So we're going to take that. Oh, nice. I like that. I like it. You know, you can make pianos, most likely, but eh, who cares? I've just got one free. So we could get a Nazar off this. If I get it in the first drop, I won't be happy. No, I didn't. All right. I was going to say, if I get it in the first drop, I'll just be like, what? No way. So many jungle creepers that have spawned in here. Look how many bookcases there are. That's just ridiculous. Three in a row. They're trash the book. No, these are different bookcases. All right, then. I'll take those as well. Why not? Trash the silver bars, because we don't really need those. And we'll take the blunge... Blue dungeon bookcases, the blungeon. <laughs> yeah, tenor. See, this cursed schools are spawning all the time now. What is going on? This world is good. Uh, last time I went in this world, none of those were spawning. I tested it, none of them were spawning. And now it just seems they want to come all the time. Look at them all. There's a dragon skull. Don't tell me another cursed school is going to come. This is like a nice place to just sit, to be honest. We could with some water candles, but I mean... No, this is a good place to sit. Let's get some free Nazars then. Let's let's get them. Get a free Nazar. Please give me a Nazar. I'll pay you money. No, no, I won't, but... Yeah, I'll give you a Nazar. Come on. I'll give you a Nazar for a Nazar. If you give me your Nazar, I'll give you my non-existent Nazar. Deal? I think that's a good deal, to be honest. Do you reckon they'll take the bait? I don't know. To be honest, I don't think they will. That scared me for a <laughs> I wondered what that was. Hey, yeah, loads of these are spawning now. Awesome. Obviously, because this is pre-hard mode. No hard mode mobs will spawn here. So, I've got a lot of better chances of getting the czar of these mobs. I'm going to temporarily... I'm going to do something really risky. I'm going to temporarily trash that just so I can use this potion... Just so I can put these back again. I just didn't want something to happen to it. And we can seal the loot now. I like the Splunker. The Splunker potions are awesome because it gives you a nice outline of where everything is. So there's an ice chest there. And then that goes with all the other chests which are at the top. Oh, that, that is awesome. So there's some ores there as well. Whoa, look at all these mobs. So many of them. But I really hope we can get the Nazar. I just want it. I just do. Just the one that's going to be annoying me for ages. Come on, Nazar. You know you want to drop. There is no mobs yet coming towards me. But we have got the candle here. So possibly we could. We could just get it. We zoomed out. Maybe we should zoom in. And I don't know. Seeing as it's off camera anyway, shouldn't. 
I don't know if it'll spawn. No, because it's not just going to spawn in camera, is it? So if I do that, is it more chance of spawning if I do that? I, d I don't know. I don't think there's any chance. So it'll probably spawn off the camera. Then it'll come into... The well, not off the camera, but off the screen that we can see. A lot was spawning when I was standing here, it seemed. Or is that dad just gone now? Is that look gone? Or all of the, the little schools just gone away? I think they have. That's it. We're out of luck. No. I really wanted to do that as well. Oh. Here's a dragon skull. But they're not needed. We need, we need the little tiny ones. Maybe sitting here again. Maybe maybe that'll get us a few. Come on. You know you want to come to us. Please give us a Nazar. I will literally pay you for the Nazar. Come on. I'll, I'll give you two gold coins out of my ten gold coins. Come on. That's, that's a good deal. Two gold coins. I think the way you could buy with that. You could buy you could buy a mechanic with that. Come on. Now loads of these guys want to spawn. I don't want dragon skulls. Unless they give me a Nazar, which they don't. Whoa, angry bones galore. Jeez. I might just make it rain here. That way that they'll automatically get attacked and then any. Any little schools that might come up will get killed by me. That looked really weird. <laughs> it looked like it was sidestepping. So we're only going to stay here for another few more minutes because I really wanted a Nazar fast, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. At the start, I thought, oh, they're spawning all the time, but now they just don't want to spawn at all. They hate me. The dungeon slime. Yeah. Oh, here's one. Come on, Nazar. No, no, Nazar. The look is real. The look that you must have to have. Let's put some water candles. I know I've got the potions, but it shouldn't matter too much. We'll put two water candles down. There we go. Don't know if it affects it if you have more than one down in an area. I'm pretty sure up to three is, is, is the amount that you can use to spawn more enemies. I, I don't know. I know it increases the rates, but I just don't know how many you can do until it stops increasing the rates, basically. We don't want too many en enemies on screen, so we're going to have to kill some of those off. But good if our little minion could go down there. Should we spawn him down there? There we go. He should stay. hopefully stay down there now. Let's just attack everything that comes up. But that means any... Any new mobs. Whoa, look at those. They are sidestepping. They look so weird. <laughs> like, mega weird. No way. Come on, Nazar. Ah, oh, we don't want you dragon schools. Go home, please. That spider biome is just ridiculous. It's spawning so many sp wall creepers. How many golden keys do we have as well? Look at them all. Just a ton of gold keys. I think even if we got a Nazar, I probably wouldn't know. So we don't need that. We don't really need dart traps. And blue bricks I'll keep just, just for for the sake of keeping them, I guess. There's, there's no other reason to keep them. I just feel like it. I've just picked up a load of trash again. It's because they drop bombs and stuff, isn't it? Blue dungeon vase. I don't want a blue dungeon vase. <laughs> Dragon skull. No, come on. We need those little tiny skulls. What's going on? Give us some baby skulls now. We demand the baby skulls. When do we want them? Now. What do we want? Baby skulls. When do we want them? Now. And I've totally forgot what they're called. Baby skulls, little skulls. No clue. But no schools want to spawn for me. This is sad. There's no, no schools that want to spawn at all. I guess it's because the amount of mobs is hitting the maximum. But that shouldn't really stop them from spawning in. There's one. Come on. No. We want a Nazar. We don't, we don't want all your rubbish. Blue dungeon door. We're not going to need the blue dungeon door. I don't even know why we need the chairs, to be honest. Get them at any time anyway by going into numerous worlds. Just looting it all. Pretty sure I've got enough anyway. Not that I make loads of houses with them. Just fun to have, I guess. 
So I noticed they, they spawn more when you move around. So if we move around, they should hopefully spawn a little bit more. Come on. Come on. Is it going to work or not? I don't even know. This this episode is going to be so long. Just me talking about an Azar. But yeah, we have a lot of other pets to get. I'm going to go in my ice biome soon. I don't know. Where's the ice biome from here? So it's over there. And if we can get some ice chests, we can see we get the fish. I don't believe I've already got the penguin. So we try and get the penguin. Come on, Nazar. Ah. The amount of times people have got Nazars. And I can't even get one. My luck is just out. Not even joking. My luck is just so bad. On Terraria. Or Terraria, however you pronounce it. No. I'm just out of luck, literally. There's one. Come on. Three, two, one. Nazar. Ah. No Nazar. Don't think these dragon schools can even draw. Ooh, nice. Another one. Nope. No Nazar for me today. Get a load of golden keys. Ooh, there's another one. They're spawning a lot now. I'm really liking this spawn rate. Could it maybe be night time or something? I, I don't know. Ooh, another one. Come on. No. Just drop me a Nazar. Is it that much to ask for? Like, really? Is it that much to ask for? All I want is an R. I'm not asking for, for a Terra Blade for a drop, am I? Not that you can get that, but, you know, pretty much comparing it to the impossible. I'm not asking you for, to drop a, a, I don't even know, a Stardust Dragon. <laughs> not that you can even get those on console either. So again, comparing it to the impossible. All I want is one Nazar. Not even asking for two. I just want one. That's all I want. A Nazar. And I know, I know it's going to be a joke, because as soon as I get one, I'm just going to find them everywhere. I just, I just know I am. I'm just going to find them in every single place that I possibly could. Someone, that just spawned on, that was weird. That just spawned directly on me. Where are all the enemies now, then? There just seems to be no enemies to kill. So we might need some bow potions to come back and do this. I'm on... Something that I'll probably do off camera, to be fair, because it's taken so long just to get an Azar. I mean, honestly, how bad an outlook can you get? Obviously, really bad outlook if you're me. Like, mega. This can't literally... Oh, there's one. Again, no Nazar. I know it's like a, a rarish drop and all, but... Seriously, this, this amount of kills, I'm not getting a single one. Please. Come on, Curse School, just drop one. Bro, you know you want to drop one for me. Like, literally, I don't know why they won't drop one. So we're going to go down here again, and hopefully when we go back round... Another dungeon slot. We don't need gold keys. We've got... 58 gold keys. What are we ever going to use those for, really? We're never going to use 58 gold keys. That is like... No. Come on. Got another gold key. 50,000 gold keys later. And maybe I'll get one Nazar. I'll trade you 10 gold keys for a Nazar. Come on. The next one that appears, if, if he does, I'll give him 12 gold coins. Nope. He, he just, just don't like the offer, does he? I think it's the offers that I'm giving them. They just don't like them. They don't like the bribes. don't like to be bribed. They just, they just want their own way not to give me the Nazar. This whole episode is just going to be like, Nazar, yeah. Like, you're going to be you're gonna be in a, a sleep and you're going to just be... Dreaming about a Nazar now. I've said it so many times. It's like trying to implement it into people's brains when I'm not. It just all I want is one. <laughs> and you just don't want to give me one. You don't like me. Nazar, like I said, I said it from the start. The Nazar just don't like me. Literally. Just. I do love this dungeon though. This dungeon's epic. 
Imagine if he dropped somewhere when he was using my horseman's blade. I'd, I'd actually cry if that happened. If I found out he'd just drop somewhere. <laughs> what What if I go into a place where not a lot of mobs can get, but but only like they can get me, like here. If I sit here, for example, no other mobs can get me, but the cursed schools. They're the only things that can really get me up here, I guess. But obviously things are spawning below then. Hmm. Probably wouldn't work, would it? If anyone knows an efficient Nazar farm that's not hard to build, that I could quickly emulate, then please do link it below. That's if I still need it by the end of this episode, because I have no clue if I will still need it. Probably will still need it, because I'm out of luck on every episode about it. Literally every episode. But once we have that Nazar, I can make my ankh shield. Nope. Just nothing. Absolutely nothing. Gonna try. If the next one don't drop it, I'm just gonna leave this place. Never come back. Ever again. Ugh, why can't we just get one Nazar? People get it in their first kill. There's me. A thousand kills later. Oh, no Nazar for you. They're not going to drop it, are they? That's it. I'm gone. I'm done in here. Nope. That's me done. I'm going to go back up now. And I'm going to go and check out some of the ice biome. So let's just go through. I know I've left. Oh, Cursed Skull. Come on. Can he give us the Nazar? Please give us one. Please do. Okay. He didn't. Fair enough. It doesn't always matter that much, I guess. Come back for it one day. Yeah, one day. Come back for it every day and it still won't be there. <laughs> like, literally, you could be there for ages trying to get this. Whereabouts is my... Mm, the ice bind is a bit far away. I mean, it's not a problem. Would be really funny, though, if, if, if one just dropped him as are now. I'm just gone. Like, he's just trailing behind or something. I mean, no. Just out. That that just really annoy me if that did happen. I'm just there. And the Nazar is just lying there. So we're going to head over to the ice bone. See if we can open a few ice chests. Let's go through here. Hmm. Can't seem to find anything at the minute. Slowly make our way through. I think I see a chest over there. Ooh, I forgot about the eye. They're not going to be too hard, though. Is it going to be any chests? Pretty sure I saw something over here. But we're going to come back into this biome next episode. I'm going to going to release the next episode, hopefully the next day after this one. Because I know this episode hasn't really been too long. But I really want that. It's just the thing that's been bugging me for a while now. I know you guys are probably like, you've done about 10 episodes on it. It's literally because I can't get a single one. I'm going to try find one, though. Hmm. This is a crimson world, isn't it? Yeah, it's got all the crimtain ores around. So I think I'm going to spend a little bit of time after this organising all my chests. And then, once I've organised them all, I can easily find things. I think that's the next step. What I can do on my world. So don't really need the Hermes boots. Let's just get them anyway. Can I see any chest or sort of activity? Spider biome over there. Nothing else much more. 
Hmm. So anyway, guys, like I say, this episode hasn't been too long. But I'm hoping to release a, a longer one tomorrow. And I'll try and upload three this week. So, you know, I can have sort of consistency. Then I'll try to keep that consistent. But anyway, guys... Hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like, subscribe, stay frosty, and peace.